We're back. Okay, no more problems. There we go. What's this? Candies. Trail of treats. I'm on the right path. Yay. No the honors, no nothing. The clones do their work. Kitchen stole a hunk of meat. Cook gave him a licking, strung him by his feet. Cooked and bled him empty, stripped his skin off clean. Oof. Laughter said how tasty, best sausage I have seen. Cook's a stupid killer, shouldn't have ate the pup. Now we're light a fire, gonna roast him up. One, two, three, the one to fetch the kindlings. The. The. Interesting rhyme. Nice. Don't know you. Go away. I'm looking for the witches of Crookback Bog. You look like a witch yourself. Ha! Huh. Witches? Of the bog? We can't go in the bog. Gran don't let us. Ooh. When my brother Zamek went missing, Gran said it was because he went in the woods and got lost. Gran cried an awful lot after that. He could still come back. No. What are you doing out here alone? Well, he's not alone. He's with Gran. But where did you all come from? We's orphans. All of you? There's a war. So there's orphans. Didn't know that. Yeah. A young woman got lost in the swamp. She has ashen hair and a scar mm. on her face. You can see anyone like that? Ain't no lassies here. What am I? You're no lassie. Lassie's got texts. <laughs> heard an old man say once when the army was here. He says, item losses in the woods. He's dazzling the soldiers with their tits. And it's torturing the poor lads. That's what he said. SMH. Anyone else here besides you? I mean, you knew. Someone who might have seen the woman? Like the six eyed tree? Tree slapped all year. But there is Johnny. What's this talk? What kind of jabbering is this, eh? Jabbering. No one allowed here. Just mm. kids. My kids. They're allowed. But who are you? Wearing swords like a bandit. Who's Johnny? Johnny, Johnny, eat a cat. Come the more in some furry shot. Watch your <laughs> language. They tell tales and tales. Nor but tales. Are you one of the witches of the swamp? I hear Crookback Bog. Witch? Me? Nay, I've no broom nor owl and not mm. one wart on me nose. Got a pretty nose, Damn see? Again. Gran's got a lovely beak. Oh, you darling girl. Oh, kids are so sweet. You look after these kids? They're my grandchildren. Gran's good to us. Gonna be soup with scratchings for supper. Nice. Kids get lost in the woods. I miss them. Seen them in the woods? No one has. Just talking to the kids, asked them if they'd seen a young woman. Oh, I was a lovely young woman. Wore a long, was, beautiful braid my mummy did up for me. Had dresses with flowers on them. Maybe you've seen her. Young, ashen hair. Your betrothed. Daughter, actually. Daughter? My daughter. Dear, sweet little daughter. And her sister. Where are they now? Maybe they've come to some harm. A bit of help, please. A young, ashen-haired woman. Just need to know if you've seen her. What are you looking at, children? Wash your hands, we'll go catch crickets. Won't learn anything from you. Aye, because I don't know nothing. Ooh. That Johnny knows. He knows a lot. 
when I ask him something, he says, wait, I'll scratch my arse and tell you. Ugly word. What you saying? To the hut. You'll stand in the corner. I'll make sure you do. You. Be gone. Be gone. Be gone. Talk to the boy. The rope. Can't come in here. Not allowed in here. I just want to talk to the boy. Not allowed. It's not allowed. Not allowed. I won't talk to you anyway. Gran don't like you. And and Johnny's made up. And I'm stranger still, kids. Just tell me where I can find Johnny. Johnny's made up. Be gone. Be gone. Oof. Why don't you want to talk about Johnny? One of you knows about him. The others must too. It's just him who's pals with Johnny. They pick mushrooms and hunt snails. But Gran says Johnny's made up. Have any of you ever seen Johnny? Of course. Looks just like him. Then why do you say he's made up? Gran says so. And Gran knows lots. Right. Does your Gran treat you right? She ever hurt you? Never. When we're bad, she cries. She's scared. Says strangers might take us. And we'll disappear. The boy who plays with Johnny, he must be brave. Not brave, just stupid. Sat his bare bum on an anthill once. Yeah. But yeah. He plays with Johnny. He don't listen to Gran and goes in the woods, and then he's got to have a time out. Any snail. The girl I mentioned is in danger. You gotta help me get your Gran away from the hut so I can talk to Johnny's friend. All right, but you've got to do something for us too. Play hide and seek. Gran never does. Says her feet hurt. Points play. You hide. But if I find you, you have to help me talk to the boy who knows Johnny. He thinks he'll find us easy. Means he's never hid from the black ones. No looking, and you have to count out loud. All your fingers, toes, too. One, two, two. three, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Ready or not, here I come. Nice. Whoop. Wait. Up there, right? All right. Found you. You can stop hiding. Aww. Yay. You can't hide from me. Two? I can see you. No fair. Are you supposed to win? Right. There you are. Ta. Found me. In the last one. Wait, marker? Huh. Found you. Every last one. But nice. you found me last! Let's go back to the cottage! Can we tell him I let you find me? No. Found you all. Now you gotta keep your word and help me talk to Johnny's friend. Why wouldn't we? Promised, didn't we? Yeah. Bumble 
will be the Jagner in yours. No. Run, come. That's me. Don't be afraid. Don't know nothing. I won't hurt you. Where's Gran? She's busy. They're winning some. I don't know. Why are you scared to talk? Skipping a lot of frames. Of nothing. You're all scared of something. Would have told me about Johnny otherwise. I'm worried about Johnny. He don't come round no more. Once, when we was mushroom picking, I saw his burrow. But Gran yelled at me. Said not to talk to strangers. Cause then kids go missing. Said no PS4. She worries yeah. about Johnny too. Though she she says he's made up. Where are you and your friend's parents? Dead. Some starved. Others were killed. Killed. Like Oof. mine. One day, they went out at dawn to look for berries in the woods. Still some around back then. When I was coming home, I heard the yells. Then laughing. Went up and hid in the bushes near the woods. My mum yelled. Had the soldiers laugh. Lay my pot down by the barn door. Is it clean off? I am. I said my mum. It's all right. That's enough. I just want to talk to Johnny. He could know more than Man, the bitrate is inconsistent as fuck. Not gonna hurt him, right? Dropping from 3k to 7k. He's Imagine real. that. Jesus. He's not made up. I'm not gonna hurt him. Johnny used to be boy, cause Gran liked listening to his songs. When we was picking mushrooms, Johnny said he saw a girl with ashen hair in the swamp. Dude. Where can I find Johnny? There is a little meadow on the edge of the swamp. This Strange tree grows there. Strange tree. Look around. You'll see him. Thank you. Alright. Hunt for Johnny now. Prepare for downers, right? Yep. And a hag as well, yikes. Gonna hang your head from my saddle. He actually got me. Lost footprints. What? There we go. Somewhere around here. Yeah, there we go. Tracks lead to a burrow. Wonder what's inside. Johnny, get over here. Johnny. Johnny Bravo. Don't be afraid. You're a Bucca? Nope. A Luton? Nope. Ah, a godling. Not many of you 
left. I'm looking for a woman with ashen hair. Seen her? Yeah. Tell me everything from the start. Where did you see her? What was she doing? It's important to me. No. Why not? Hmm. You know the kids from the clearing well? Don't be afraid. Not gonna hurt anyone. This where you live? Proud owner of his own borough. Cozy borough. Good location. Must know about everything that happens in the bog. Doesn't bother you having monsters for neighbors? <laughs> What's wrong? Can't talk? Why? Lost your voice? Nice game of strength. Can I help you here. somehow? No enemy incoming, right? Can't understand you. Try to explain it somehow. <laughs> His face falls. Amazing. Want me to follow you? Yeah. No choice, I guess. Let's go. Ooh, that's some nice XP. Johnny fellow. Stay close to me. Come on, come on. Try it over here. This the place? Let me look around. Something's on the ledge. Something that'll get you your voice back. Nice. Guess I gotta make this climb. Climb these nuts. Eee. bottle nice that's it that's it we slide the creature basically looks like a woman without yeah. makeup oh boy <laughs> whoa Nice. <laughs> Done celebrating. My favorite words. Life without savoring the sound of surreptitious shenanigans is like licking snails through a cloth. Thank you for this, noble whoever you are. Long be your life. 
Hey, oh, hey, Hang oh. on a minute. I helped you, now you help me. Would you turn this beautiful act of altruism into a banal bartering of favors? How'd you lose your voice? One morning I awoke and opened my mouth for my usual bout of singing with the thrushes. Lo and behold, no sound escaped. I tried and tried, almost burst a blood vessel. Then I went to the village, because word has it, the new cunning woman works miracles. But people began crying out, a smudger, a smudger, <laughs> and sick their dogs on me. Do I look like a smudger to you? Uh, no. Not a bit. Well, I thought not. So it must be the crones doing. Who else would curse me? Blackbird friend of mine located my voice, but I was helpless to retrieve it. Couldn't ask a raven friend to just give you the bottle? Ravens serve the crones. They don't have no one. Damn. How do you lock someone's voice in a bottle? Just wondering. As am I, especially as mine's a voice to crown all voices. <laughs> all Sometimes voices. it's like a forest brook. At others, like a roll of thunder. And let's be honest, I talk enough to fill three barrels or more. Somebody yeah. used some powerful magic on you, as a prank or just to be mean. I'm looking for a young, ashen-haired woman. See anyone like that? Did I ever? Remember it as yeah. if it were yesterday. Soon as I woke, I went to empty my bowels. My favorite part of the day. <laughs> Who's this? Navigating to the sunrise, downright glorious. Suddenly, heard a bang. So loud, it couldn't have been me. And that lass appeared. Out of nowhere. Young, ashen-haired. Just like you said. Wounded and panting to boot. She raced off towards the children's hut. Quick as if the crones were after her. I yelled some unpleasantries. She disturbed my morn. Sadly, I'd lost my voice. So I don't think she heard me. Oof. What do you know about the crones? They're as old as this forest. Cruel, vindictive, not to be crossed. What if someone does cross them? Might take his voice, might take his life. Depends on their whim. Oof. They're nasty, although they care for this land and its folk in their own way. Supposedly, they always keep their word. But you must be careful what you ask for. Won't find them until they want to be found. See them until they want to be seen. But remember, they see and hear all that happens in the mire. Okay. I've been to the village in the swamp. Met a woman who might have been a crone. Did she seem confused to you? Nuts. Completely. Oof. So I'm not crazy. <laughs> That's no crone. That's the granny who takes care of the orphans. Claims the kids made me up. Me. An orphanage in a swamp? What do you have against swamps? Lived here my own life, and I heartily recommend it. She ran off toward the orphanage. Kids could know something, or the old woman who takes care of them. Oh, that old hag don't speak to strangers, and you're a stranger. Will she talk to you? I have spoken to her, got my ways. So be it. Ugh. You helped me, and I'm no bore. Come with me. Ah, back to the swamp beach. All right. Oh yeah, it's closed. And he's waiting for me. Oh come on. Go already. No, no. Another hag. Watch out! Oh nice. Whoa! This left in my swing. That's an H. Nope, nope, nope. You like that silver. Got it for way too much. Ooh. 
Come on, Johnny, go, 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 go. Nice. Good. It's clear. Not a crone in sight. I need to sing to Grand. That ought to calm her. Really now. Little Johnny softly gazes, fire waning pale. Pop a spark jumped out and whispered, Listen, I will tell. You. I got your voice back. I did. No, that mug I is ugly. Lost an octave somewhere in the process. I shall look for it when I get home. You're not allowed here, Johnny. You shouldn't have come. Calm down, Gran. Don't get angry. It's not good for you. The woman I asked about earlier. Forgive me, Gran, but this fellow absolutely must talk to the ladies. No, she's not allowed. Please, it's important. The fellow will be quiet. Gran, please hear me out. I found little Yagna when she got lost, did I not? Yes. Did I break Jenny's fever too? I did. I ask anything in return? No. Didn't even fuss about my stolen voice. Well, now I want something. Gran, help this fellow. Because otherwise he'll pester me day and night, even during potty time. His lass is missing. Perhaps the ladies can help find her, eh? Mayhaps. Well, since you put it that way, Johnny, I'll help him. Come with me. Come with me if you want to live. So are the lights in the back, or is it one speed? How the fuck would I know? Johnny's a good, good lad. Though the ladies don't like him. No. Foul creature, they hmm. say. Don't like him. Who are the women in the tapestry? Those are the ladies. Ladies, lovely. With power over all. Beseech I thee. Answer my call. Before you, a worm crawls, wretched, wretched and, and small. small. The Undertaker. How dare you disturb our rest, woman? Someone speaking through you? Good looking and clever too. Don't know, each time you asked me to explain done. something. Well, I didn't fuck it up. It was she who set it up, so how would I know? I'm looking for the woman with ashen hair. I know you met her. Where is she? Oh, he's impatient. Perhaps he only likes ashen haired girl. She's my daughter by choice. I raised her by choice. <laughs> if she's shapely, what does it matter? <laughs> Matters to me. I believe we fit a nerve. He's bubbling like wealth and yeast. Oh, that's how I like him. Oof. It's clear you met her. She's Tell a witch. me everything. Oh, yeah. That was blunt. Well, perhaps it's for the best. Tell me, have you got bollocks? Do you fear woodland beasts? No. Oh, hard times are upon this white-haired one. Brother has turned against brother. The land is soaked in blood. Evil reigns stronger than ever before. A dark power has surfaced near down warren. Uh, kill it, uh, soon to him. Dark power? You need a knight errant, or a witch hunter, not a witcher. 
The Alderman of Down Warren will tell you all. Remember to collect payment from him after you complete your task. Nice. And now our servant will bring you the dagger. The dagger. A dagger? What for? When the Alderman sees this dagger, he'll know we sent you. He'll aid with all. Death ear in her hand. I'll talk to the alderman, but I can't promise anything. Ooh, woman, give the young man the dagger. And you, white one, return only once you've completed the task. Oof. Damn. Oh, you mistress, right on me way. Dagger, gotta bring the dagger. The dagger. Do have a license for this dagger? To give it you. Here it is, the dagger. Damn. Place the alderman's payment on the stone. All right. Stone bear, stone shear, stone nose, stone ears. Time to loot the place. <laughs> Whoop, nice. Beastery. The Kamaras. Oh, yeah. The high vampires. Oof. And. Yep. Fast traveling that short amount of distance. It's a shame on me. Greetings. Nice village. No. Aye. A real pearl of the swamps. If you say so. <laughs> you get by alright? Aye, winter to winter. Somehow we survive. Recognize this dagger? Yeah. I master. I didn't know you belonged to them. Don't belong to anyone. Down to business. I want to get this done quickly. Ah, so that's how it's to be. I'm supposed to help solve your problem. Tell me what it is. Just the essentials. The war awoke an ancient power. An evil one that feeds on bloodshed. I am. Nightmares haunt our nights and days. Folks sleepwalk from their homes, never to return. Under the tree on the Whispering Hillock they lie. On the Whispering Hillock. All fathers, sons, daughters, and mothers. Folk are afeard to move them. You must go there. The dark powers must be cast off. More details. Need more details. You must see for yourself. Grand's mum whacked me crosswise for straying near the Whispering Hillock. <laughs> what happens there now is a wonder. A few times folk from round here gathered to chop down the trees and burn the cursed soil back to use. None returned. The ground neath the weeds is white with human bones. Damn. When did all this start? Three year back. I remember, twas a warm day. Went to check the snares for game. Pulled the hair from me trap. It grew dark all of a sudden, though it was nigh on noontime. I thought it was a storm at first. A squeal pierced the air, near burst me ears. The hair rotted in me hands. And the leaves shriveled and yellowed, though it were yet the start of summer. Damn. Imagine that scene. been ill ever since. Folks' teeth turn black as charcoal. Women folk fight like polecats, bawling and Brawling over nothing. Women full fight? Oh, that's first. The young'uns, born crippled, lame, fear and cursing. Long have we pled for the lady's help. No, the ladies right. of the wood don't know what this power is. They know all. Old Thecla claimed they'd be punishing us. Thecla. Folks stop respecting them. Some even call them witches. But must not be they. For they sent you. I'll look around the whispering hillock. You be careful, Master Witcher. 
Don't you treat this evil light. All right. Out we go. Now prepare for the screams. Or oh, a scream, I don't know. Ruin tower. Oh. It's a marker. Has to be somewhere something here. There we go. Oh. Yikes. Well, I saw something. Oh no 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 no. If it resolves, I'm hightailing. It resolves. Yeesh. Get out of here. Looks like rain. Well, fang bites. Fang bites. Yeesh. Got this. Got this. Oof. Be gone. Come you no closer. Well, well. I know when we be gone. Be gone. Be gone. The powers will not relent. Imagine the werewolf just to come an enemy. Thanks. Come on. Wolves, come on. Oh, it's the marker, dummy. Yeah. Wait, I'm missing something, right? Oh no, I don't know. Whoa, what? Yep. So I'm gonna jump out. Anything to loot? New. No. Oh, there we go. No. Yes. Damn. That's a lot of nuts. There we go. Easy. Merchant 
did as I await, and my forest protects me. Murderers? Murderous sisters killed my body. Now my soul may hunt, for I did by them. Who are you? Who are you? I abandoned my circle, where I had kept the balance. The crones killed me. And cursed my ghost. Oof. Never heard of a druid circle in Velen. I wander eternally through a maze of vows, helplessly sliding or rustling. You must know the crowns pretty well. They are Velen's curse. They hear all through severed ears. They weave hair and twist lines. They take their strength from the broth of human flesh. Why did they kill you? The crones want this land. They drew the wood alone. The wood. <laughs> I stood in their way. I had to die. You claim to be imprisoned. How so? I am bound here in fetters of magic. I wandered endlessly. A love of thieves. The children. I know all. I know what to bring with them. Free me, please. I must help. If something threatens the orphans, I'll help them myself. The children have been taken. Free me, please. I come be a gale. A gallop unchained. I shall save them. Only I can. Huh. Now a choice. The kids from the meadow are in danger. The sisters took them. They shall not return. Where they take them, I can help. It is done already. It cannot be undone. There are no roads to art ceremony. No roads. They shall all die. Let them be saved. The crowns. What do you know about them? The sisters are older than the oldest trees. Melon is their realm. All life here serves them. The sisters live concealed. You will not find them. They hear all. You cannot hide. Uh, I don't believe you. Boom. I don't believe you, spirit. Too many claim you're evil. Your words alone, not enough. Dead. And against you will rise all the powers of nature. And dragons. There we go. Oh, an aggravated one. Oh, yeah. Growth and decoction. Yeah. And that's it. Nice. And I came from here. Do you have any loot for me? You whispering her look? No. Huh, could have entered from here. 
Oh well. Damn. Solved your problem. Just in case, though, avoid the whispering hillock for a while. Cannot be. Where's something lurking there? An evil spirit had possessed a evil tree on spirit. the hill. It was responsible for the killings. How'd ye dispel this evil? Some being had come to possess the tree's heart. I destroyed the heart and its what? inhabitant. So it were a ghost. Will it be back? No. The crones, or the ladies of the wood as you call them, said to remind you about payment. Take it you know what they want? Oof. Aye, I do. Give me the dagger. Be back soon. Oh no, 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 no. <laughs> there is like, what the fuck? Take it to the ladies, will you? What the hell was that? Tis our pact. Uh, you're a stranger. You don't know life here. It's honest pay for their protection. So, all those ears in the woods... Put it out your mind, master. You soon be leaving and we must tarry on. Our young'uns and their young'uns after them. No gods nor yes. masters watch over Velen. The land is no man's. Yeah. He who wants to survive... Must seek his own protectors. Yeah, no man's land. Wait, hunting boots, hunting armless. Wood. Hello. <laughs> By player account. <laughs> Good. Your life, you're different than you were in the tapestry. Well, bring it here. Well, never seek to cross us again. We shall forgive you this transgression for your done well. Your children are plump with piglets, sweet as caramel. But now we must talk to our white haired friend. White haired. I know that, Mark. This is Anna, the wife of the Baron of Crow's Perch. She belongs to no man. It's Anna. A fruit ripened in her womb. A fruit sprouted from seeds sown by a man she detested. We helped her. She agreed to serve. She bears the mark. She is ours. Come. It is another woman bitch. who interests you. Speak, white-haired one. You used me. You used me to tame the Whispering Hillock. A lot of work. Not spring, brave soul. Did you destroy the evil powers? Have you brought peace to our domain? Yes. So fortunate to have found so brave a knight, so able. 
Well, the kids fall. Uh... Whose spirit was trapped in the tree? That of one who once cheated death. But she couldn't deceive you, brave knight. You've rid the world of a great evil. Damn. You looked different in the tapestry. We're all dressed up just for you. Yeah. If you only knew how much time we spent in front of the glass. Do you desire us? <clears throat> I'm impressed. Polymorphism, a rare talent. Oh, I'd suck every last drop out of you. Really now. Ah, to be woven together with you? I'd be your best and last. <laughs> Not what I came for. Damn. Our deal. I did my part, now you do yours. A word once given, we never break. The girl. Mousy blonde. That's what they call it. Blonde? Thin as a nail. Terrified. Exhausted. She could then stun the poor thing. We cared for her as best we could. Like she was our own daughter. Oof. Wasted affection. She proved a very naughty girl. Mischievous, stubborn, and selfish. Ah, don't believe you. The young woman I seek never hurt anyone without cause. You've not seen her long. She's changed for the worse. Why'd she attack you? She's no longer the girl you once knew. Wrath consumes her. Yeah, all right. Don't believe you. They say you always keep your word. So tell me everything, exactly as it happened. We shall tell you, little boy. Damn flashbang. We knew someone's supposed to be the beast for the omens. We would glimpse her likeness, a mirage in a puddle. She came from the lower swamp. We knew not at first it was her the omens had spoken of. A child of the elder blood, the same seed that would burst into flame. But if she carries her death easily, she's like 10 feet tall, at least. She fell into our hands. Elder blood! Ah, oh, that, that clipping, oof, game, oof. Piecing out. Nope. Oh, escape. I just have to escape. Okay. 
Bye then. Do I have to skip? Sure. Why not? Still okay. Nice horse armor, my dude. to butcher her like an animal and eat her. Her blood, the taste brought back the memories of our youth. Elder blood. Extraordinary girl. But you know that. Such a shame she fled. Hmm. She escaped you, but I'll find her. We'll come back here together and kill you. You return, you shall. Our fates are bound. Bound. And one will die. But it shan't be one of us. Really? Now you shall chase shadows and wander midst fog. Each time you see her, she will be a mirage. Oh, they're cursing me. Oof. And if you find her, if. <laughs> well, Imlareth. All right. Wait, where's the marker? The kids are gone, by the way. They ate them. SMH. Cosperch. Come on. Quest now? No, yeah, no. Where's that later? I keep forgetting. Fucking shit eater. <laughs> what the fuck? Go away. Hmm. No, well, those are gone, so. Okay, yes. Hello. I'm listening. What do you come to me with? Got news of your wife. Why do you not say so forthwith? Where is she? Why have you not returned with her? She's in Crookback Bog. Got food, place to live, and keeps herself busy. Didn't look like she had the slightest desire to leave. Damn. You were to bring her back, not report on the condition she lives under. I was supposed to find her, and I did. That was our deal, nothing more. You still think me rotten to the core? A <laughs> base bastard, don't you? Yeah. You believe I alone am at fault for what happened here? Maybe.
Doesn't matter what I believe. Yet, looking at you, I see contempt. Can't speak for the world you witches inhabit, but in ours, nothing is ever black and white. Tell me. We're gonna say you're not the only one to blame. All right then, I'm willing to hear your side of the story. Leander, it was love at first sight. A spear tore through my shoulder at the Battle of Anker. She tended to my wound. Once I'd recovered, I asked her to marry me. She wept with joy. Soon after, Tamara was born. And after that, they sent me to Sidaris. A warlord had risen against King Athen, and Faltest sent help. It was one battle to the next, one conflict after another. It was a life of war. I was seldom home, and I found comfort Ooh. in drink. Grew so fond of hooch, I couldn't part with it when I did get home. Still seems like your fault. <laughs> Will you let me finish? All right. What then? I went from front to front, battle to battle, collecting soldiers' coin, while Anna sat alone with the babe for months. Later, I learned she'd not been so alone after all. For nearly three years, she'd found comfort in the arms of one Evan, Oof. a childhood friend, a dog's bunghole. Understand, damn it! One tussle in the hay I'd have waved aside, put it out of my mind. But the woman cuckolded me for years, without a whisker of concern for me, for my love. How do you find out? Came home one day and Anna was gone. The things too. Oh yeah. The letter. She wrote that she didn't love me. That she'd left me for that knob liquor and taken tomorrow. A knob liquor. <laughs> Felt like I'd been rammed in the ass by a horse. <laughs> I went to find the bugger to get the girls back, bring them home. Yet soon as I saw him, something oh, yeah. turned inside me, something dark. I slaughtered the shit eating twat and fed his carcass to the dogs. Oof. I guess they call you the Bloody Baron for a reason after all. What? Your nickname makes sense now. No, no, that's an entire. <laughs> this this is the nickname. <laughs> Imagine Anna wasn't exactly pleased. Ha! Bloody understatement if I've ever heard one. She flew into a fit, hysteria, threw herself at me, kicking and clawing. Finally grabbed a knife. Knife. Side. It was the first time I hit her. I had to calm her. Felt I had no other means. Things changed. They would never be the same. Anna tried to take her own life and mine several times. She would prod me, goad me, taunt me in the hope I would hit her again, perhaps. She'd scream that I'd robbed her a life of love. But I destroyed the idea for her, and so I might as well kill her. Damn. How many times I apologized. How many armfuls of blooms and gifts I brought. She cared not a bit. Two years of her anger had turned to indifference. Broken at times were her bouts of hysteria, and my bouts of drunkenness. Cannot Yikes. fathom how we survived those years. But we did. Though as you know now, not everything was as it might have seemed. I can't say I care. <laughs> You're right. Faults on both sides, yours and hers. I'm content that you finally see that. Very well then. If you won't bring Anna home, you might at least tell me how she landed in that blasted swamp. Hey, level up. You're 
wife is with the crones as their servant. What the fuck do you mean? What crones? Ones who live in Crookback Bog. Oh, I've heard folk speak of them. I thought it naught but tales to scare the children with. How on earth did she land there? They fled by night. They were riding past the forest when a beast serving the crones attacked them and abducted Anna. A beast? Bloody hell. And Tamara? Was she hurt? No. no. Oh, thank the gods for that. So, Annie, what happened to her? The creature carried her deep into Crookback Bog. Didn't harm her, though. In fact, Anna seems content there. Content? What is this tribe, Witcher? What in bloody blazes is she doing in that swamp? She made a pact with the crones and... Well, I think she might have lost her mind. A pact? What the bloody hell? Yeah, <laughs> what the bloody hell? She was with child. A child she didn't want to bear. Went to the crones for help. They promised to rid her of the problem in exchange for a year of her service. And they kept their word in their own twisted way. What do you mean? Anna must have thought the child inside her would somehow disappear. Instead, the crone sapped her of strength and ultimately forced her body to miscarry. I think that's when she started to lose her mind. Then they placed magic tethers on her. Tethers that cause great pain when tested. A guarantee she'll pay off her debt. A pact with witches. Oof. Bloody nightmare. Sounds like some jest. We must get her out. We can't leave her there. Hmm. Venturing into the swamp, even with armed men, is just a bad idea. It's a dangerous place inherently. And I think those crones are a greater threat than anyone realizes. Really? I'll not sit on my ass waiting for them to return her. Would you wait? Count on their mercy if they had your daughter? Probably Indeed. not. But I'm a witcher. And I'm a husband and a father who's fucked up his life and the lives of his loved ones. I'll gather my men. Go there and retrieve Anna. <laughs> Let's play Gwent. <laughs> Fuck. We had a deal. I've done my part. Your turn to do yours. A word once given. Now what did I last? Basilisk. It just attacked you. Ah, right. Gargantuan. One solid brute. Brute. Ah, damn flashbangs. It landed right in front of us. I thought we'd breathed our last. Watch out! If I don't survive this, you're to take whatever you want from the forces. You'll survive! <sighs> Let's show this bastard what we're worth! <laughs> Yeah, oh, come on. Nope. Whoa. Hey, easy. Oh. Time to eat, right? Oh, damn it! Can't leave him like that. Oh. That's it. I climbed one piece and it's a cutscene.
<laughs> his gob smack. <laughs> Have everything? Yes, thank you. What you did for me, I, I shall never forget it. I certainly hope not. It's brought me no small trouble. Oof, dismissive. <laughs> Meaning? I must flee. Wraiths pursue me. The wild hunt. I was foolish to use the power. They're sure to have caught my scent. Wild hunt, pursuing you. I'll endanger all of you by remaining here. You must tell the people to bar their doors and windows. And no one is to wander the night. You? Where do you think you're going? Now, I ride for Novigrad. And then, who knows where. Damn flashbang. Again. She mounted and rode off. It grew awfully empty without her. Redanian armies blocked the Pontar crossing, yet you sent Ciri to Novigrad. She was looking for a sorceress, and all of them are in Novigrad. Besides, I didn't leave her at the Redanians' mercy. I gave her a letter of safe conduct. Where'd you get these letters? I haven't always led this pack of jesters. <laughs> Served in the Temerian army. Redanians guard the crossing. True. But with a bit of fame and a friend here and there, well, banners and heraldry don't mean so much. So there's a chance Ciri's still in Novigrad. Thanks for helping her. It's nothing. Now you've learned what you wanted to know, you must be in a hurry. But, if you could... Spit it out. I want to go get Anna. Free her, bring her hmm. back. I don't believe she's there willingly. Must have not heard me. Any journey into the swamp is suicide. I heard you, which is why I could use your aid. I've no more tales of Siri to offer you, but go with me and I'll be generous with what I do have. Very generous. Yep, let's go. Hmm. Extra coin never hurt. Ha! True indeed. I'll round up my men and ride to Downwater. You can join us there. Fine. Sounds good. Yeah. Oof. <laughs> what the fuck is this? <laughs> that you tell me man or monster my men call him Uma and say he's a beast but he seems a man to me just hideous as idle shit Uma strange name aye strange but he gave us no other you mean he can talk hardly Oof. it was like this I asked what they called him he sat there not saying a thing trying to stick a towel Ten thousand so frames kept. Looked him in the damage. eyes and asked, "What's your name?" Gave me this damn foolish look and stammered, "Oh, Uma." And it stuck. Hmm. It doesn't look like a monster, but my medallion's trembling. Strange. Where would you find him? Funny story, actually. I won it. In a game of cards. <laughs> Must have been pretty desperate to play for that. Ah, quit your carping, smart ass. Someone wagered him and we played. If anyone was desperate, it was the bugger's former master. Funny story. How so? I went to Novigrad once to rest, indulge in the city's pleasures. Stayed at a tavern and some folk they were playing, so I joined in. Cards were kind that day. 
and one devilish hand after another. Rob the Horsons blind. <laughs> one fellow, the merchants, took it especially hard. He'd gambled away everything he'd brought from Skellige. Wanted terribly to play another hand, so I agreed. Asked him what he had to wager, and he showed me that sideshow. Not much in it for me, but fuck it, I thought. I'll give the man a chance to win something back. Luck was not with him. And Oof. Uma wound up here at Crow's Perch. End of story. Funny indeed. Hilarious. Real side splitter. Ah, you wouldn't know a good tale from a runny fart. Proper baron now. Even got a jester. Aye. Though I feel something's not right with him. How so? Well, he seems more beast than man. But there's wisdom, cunning in the bastard's eyes. Or maybe I'm imagining it. Ever run into anything like it? No. But he doesn't look dangerous. Hmm. I guess that's that. Doesn't eat much, so as long as he's no trouble, the boys might as well have some diversion. Time I was on my way. So long. Farewell. I hope you find your daughter. Where's the door? What the heck? And prove a good father to her. I thought there was a door here. What? Time to go to down one then. There we go. Oh, that's 305 XP, and I just leveled up, so even better. And uh, nothing. You. Um. Damn. 150 vitality. I'll take that. Just for now, so I can actually get uh, some HP. Three points available as well. Hmm. Potion overdose, poison blades. Ooh. Steady aim. Nope. Nope. Yeah, 300 HP. Look at that. Nope, that's not it. No. The third. Yes, meet the Baron. Now, what the hell is this? No! He's gonna get stabbed. Please, I'm begging. No. What is your ah. like, boy? Oh well. Whoop. Don Warren is then. Boop. Damn it. Which hunters? The hinds. Why the devil are they? Oh, I just walked through the little stuff. They didn't ride from Novigrad to hang two lobtits, did they? I, I don't know, my lord. They say where they were headed. Geralt! Good, you've arrived. You can't draw any meaning from this rabble's bawling. Perhaps they talk some sense after a few lashes. Well, spit it out. Where'd they go? T to the village in the swamp, Lord. Lass rode with them, asking after her mother, Constant. Lass? We must go there at once, Geralt. Yes. Agreed. Gather my men. With the swamp to cross and our cursing 
Damn inventory, look at this. I have this. Why is the game not registering? You. And you. There we go. Nothing like a few lashes in the morning to really wake up. Oh yeah. Fox ridden air for a man's brand rot in the peasants. Crowns, fuck me. What will these high seeds think of next? The crones exist. You'll know that soon enough. Right. More likely some mad old wenches making wincemeat of peasant minds. <laughs> likely Anna agreed to stay with them. Care for them out of the kindness of her heart. Good as gold, that one. All right. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Yeah. I I'm wondering why they rode the horses are just walking right now. And drowners. Oh, he was on fire. Damn it. Oh. oh, you dummy. I had him on fire. Nice. Easy. Oh shit, the rock fiend. Two rock fiends. Jeez. Look at this. The guy, is, the guy will die. Boom. <laughs> Amazing explanation. Yep, let's go. Witcher, why are you here? Tell you later. Oh shit. Oh, no, no, no. Unlike you, I'll not see her rot in this swamp. Why the hell do you think I'm here? To take her home? Oh, you'll do no such thing. You'll not lay a finger on her. Never. I'll not let you. You've a right to be cross. I was not the best husband, the best father. I know. 
Ah, no. But I've changed. Ask anyone. Geralt, come tell her. Your father, he wants to find his wife, your mother. Really? Really? I pay you much to be his yes man. Verily I say unto you that ire and vehemence can lead to naught but one's downfall. Who the bloody hell is this? <laughs> and who are you to ask so crudely? This is my commander. And that should be of no concern to a drunken swine. Tomorrow, you stand with their kind. Perhaps you'd have them torture and hang your own father. You're not my father, and I care not a bit what befalls you. Bam. <clears throat> I remind you we've a matter to resolve here. Witcher, will you help us? Wouldn't be here if I wasn't willing. I've lost five men and have little notion of what else to expect in this cursed place. No time to lose. Crones could return any minute. Ha! Huh. How do you know they're not here already? Because we're still alive. Damn, that's cool. Whoa. What's this then? Recognize me. What, what's happened to her? I said I'd do it all. Give it here. I'll scrub it again. Scrub it clean. Mother. Uh oh, fiend time. Something's coming. Get ready. Uh... What was that? Wolves? That didn't sound like wolves. Because it wasn't. Get ready. No escape. And turn you to ash. No, she doesn't miss it. Chop, chop, chop. Chop. Come on, bonk, bonk. <laughs> What the heck? Bunk, 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 bunk. Fiend! Look at the size of that thing. Oh, he's stuck. Okay. <laughs> Oh shit! Holy fuck that damage! Are you kidding me? Jeez.
Uh-oh. Nope. Don't touch me. Can't touch me. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. Damn it. to me crones have sensed us they know we're close sent the beast for anna those damned witches when will it end look what they've done to her are they not satisfied enough i'm taking her away wait She's the guy just wife. died she'll return home with me you're welcome to come with us if you wish don't touch her we leave this cursed place now she's sick weakened where would you take her in this state? Oxen first? It would mean her death. I know how to care for my mother. She's not a rag doll to be ripped from hand to hand. Let her decide. Bye. Bye for dinner. Mood pie. She's you. incapable of deciding anything you. just now. A dark spell. It must be. Help her, Witcher. I beg you. Before we do anything, we've got to get her out of here. Crones know we've come for her might send another monster, something worse than a fiend. I'll not go anywhere until you tell me you can help her. Break the spell. This is no dark spell, I'm afraid. Well, what is it then? She's been through a lot. Lost a child, was carried off by a fiend, lived in the crone's village taking care of children who are now gone. It's left its mark, as it would on anyone. So it's hopeless. You can't help her. She's to be like this. I'm sorry. I know a hermit, a very wise man with a gift for healing. Met him some time past. Lives in the Blue Mountains. Blue Mountains. I shall take her there. Might be worth a shot. I shall go with you. That's impossible, sadly. Why? You have duties. Duties deriving from your commitment uh -oh. to the Church of the Eternal Fire. Once we finish our work in Velen, we return to Oxenford. You said you'd save my mother. And I kept my word. Your father can care for her now. He care? You know him. You know what he did to her. He swears to be a changed man. And in his eyes I see true sorrow. Remorse for his sins. He will care for her. And you've a new life and new duties. To the eternal fire. Fear not. All will be well. Oof. Imagine that. You go somewhere and you have to your duties. I will find the hermit. And once she is herself again, we will find you. Swear it. You have my word, child. What? Damn. The choice were made to kill monsters. It doesn't matter who posted the notice. The coin has to be right. That's all. Witcher, don't debate. Their conscience plays no part. They just get on with it, then pick up the coin pouch tossed at their feet and set off on their way. Folk don't expect witchers to save them from themselves. 
So after the text, he was about to leave talking to the colleague boss came by and was like, we need to have a Thank meeting you, this Witcher. week. Oh no, no, no. May the eternal fire guide and protect you. Farewell. One fifty. You were right to let your father take. I'm not so sure. Could do nothing more. How could the Witcher, if she can be helped? Only a learned sage will know how. Perhaps you're right. Sacked in the morning, you're getting sacked in the morning. <laughs> Give me a moment. I must gather my thoughts myself. Fiend. Nice. Of water and you fell along so there we go loot everything look at this Oof. That's it. All right. Oof. See, one hundred minutes it will take for a quest. Imagine that. Give me a moment. I must gather my fruits myself. Which? We'll deal with the witches. Witches. All right. What's now? Fix all the shrines. Sure. Journey of the woods. Sure. The meadow widow. Sure. Ooh. Griffin school gear. Nice. Failed, yikes. Oh, uh, that's nothing, nothing. Hey, what's this? That was available, right? Anything I have that I can do later? No. Nothing here. Mm. Oh, Maribor. And you. Nice. Alright, cross perch this then. Need to unlock the new thing. To you. Won't stand by and watch you rob and murder them. Plain refuse to. Got a sensitive one. Look away, woman. <laughs> Still here. Oi! Get him! Fucking shit! Chop, chop. Damn it, you. Not good. Well. Bonk. Shit. Chop. Boom. Clean. Thank you, sir. I don't know who you are, but getting slaughtered this long. You're 
shut your trap if you want this to be done soon. The man needs to concentrate. No, 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 no. Your horse a rape in progress. I said shut it. What are you looking at? Want to be next for a thrashing? Yeah. What's going on here? Sir? My daughter, help us. My men need some diversion from time to time. They get jumpy elsewise. Oof. I can't let this happen. I won't. Figured it might end this way. Get him! And flip. Oh, he's actually hitting me. And flip. Chop. Let's give Crumb Coach a wine pour. Chop. Oof. That What's was easy. Mind? Oh, move, son. The heck? Precision ball. Awesome. Marker. Wait, not yet. What's the rush? Castle Village. A. Ah, Witcher. Greetings. Baron's not here. Rode off to find a healer for the wife, naturally. I know. Seen what's happening outside the gates? What do you mean? Baron left me in command. Told the boys to set things right, put them in order. The new, the new order. order. Oof. They're murdering and pillaging. That is the new order. And I don't give a flying fuck if you like it or not. Damn. Maybe I should send me man to the Nothing here for you. Catch something. Look at that. Get for kicks and giggles. New marker. Only well, took him eight years to add it. Yikes. Hunger's turn this and then prisoner's way. still here, what the I'll heck? I'll tell you where the loot's at. Oit. <laughs> Encouraging sounds like what I would excel at if I lived in the Middle Ages. Well, that or dying. Oof, way over here. Yeesh. Mm. One of the two, yeah, yeah. Oh, look at that. One's a black ball, one's a thin. Alright. Gonna go do this quest and gonna be enough for today. Gotta fix this fucking flame skipping shit. I hate it. What are you looking at? Bothering us poor folk. Alright, save it up. Oop. Will you join us? I gotta warn you. Do you want to be fierce? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll see you tomorrow, yeah, tomorrow. Well, the rules? not not the done yet. Fish, but no one looks askance at us. Defeat Jonah, then Spiffy, and stand physical, man, and you learn the right to face the sergeants. Valens champion. Three fights. Three fights to go. 
First here, then at the other place, and then All back right. at Cross Perch. Let's see just how fierce Jonah is. Feast your eyes on an epic clash between Jonah and the Drifter. Drifter. Feed me wench once a week. Brah. Bonk. 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 Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oof. I got smacked. Nope. Bonk. 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 Boom. One down. Drifters defeated Jonah. Could this be a new, new champion, champion. Of Valen in the making? Who can tell? You have I can. Smithy to fight. Don't put it off. All right. Hmm. Then at the end. Oh yeah, it's inside. Okay. Come on, folks. What's new now? There's no one willing to fight Smithy. There's a prize awaiting if you win. Give me what? What is it, Grey Boy? Oh, he bears it, bears it. Give Crow Perch Come on. a wide berth. What? What is Smithy here? Village champion. 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 He's on your mind. That's what I want. Oh boy. Yeah. Let's let's do this. Okay, then back in again. There we go. Fixed. It's your chance to slap around some yokels, win some coin for the pleasure. You in? Yeah. I'm ready to fight. Seventy. One and all, hear this. Betting on the next brawl will begin in mere moments. The witcher will face Smithy. <laughs> He'll pound his gob like he pounds hot iron ingots. Like I pound your mom. <laughs> come on, come closer. Nope. Easy. And the door opened. <laughs> Not bad. Might be champion yet. Easy. If it's the reigning champion you seek, head to Crow's Perch and ask for the sergeant. Sergeant. Nice. nice. Anything new we have? Wouldn't mind. No. All right. Thanks. Oh, yeah. Where's the bastard? I'm ready. Who we have here? Damn. Baron's gone, but seems business is booming. Folk are more eager than ever to see the men go at it. Let's fight. 80, oh yeah. Let's start. All right. Come to daddy. <laughs> Come to daddy. <laughs> Come on. His little tops was gonna hit like a truck. Oh shit, I misclicked. Nope. Oh, 
Oh shit! The hell? Just backhanded slap. Like, boom! You gone. What a fight! Let it be known by one and nice. all that the Witcher has defeated the sergeant and become champion of all Velen. If you've not had your fill, you'll find worthy pugilists elsewhere. Plenty of them in Novigrad. Nice. Plenty in the Skelliger Isles. Easy. Blow up. No. Look at that. I need 8 XP. Yikes. Enough is enough. Enough. Both don't object to your white monk. Alright, it's this. Volunteer new you. So yeah, mid cops and yeah. Enough for today. Thanks for coming and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye bye. Boom.